Hello, welcome to SoGoodReviews.com, the YouTube edition. We take a look at the directorial debut of David Lamb, the melodrama Goodbye Mammy. Uh, David Lamb is one of many directors coming out of Hong Kong cinema uh, who has an even streak, and it started here with melodrama. He would go on to punish hostesses in Girls Without Tomorrow and provide some of the most violent moments in a Hong Kong women in prison movie aptly titled Women's Prison. So he had his produce, a debut produced by Sam Ho, and it's an unusually well thought out and reserved melodrama considering it's the terminal disease melodrama. So it's a rich movie that when dealing with its themes and it possesses quite a remarkable depth. Uh, much of the movie takes place uh, through the eyes of little on and uh, his mom may be Superman to him but uh, those days are obviously com coming to a close and uh, Liza's way of uh, living in the moment uh, creates the most heartbreaking ill de decisions she makes over the course of the movie. Uh, the orphanage, which the majority of the movie is set in, is an, an entirely inappropriate environment to live in though. These abandoned children, for different reasons, uh, stick together, fight together, are up to no good together. But but here's the uplifting spirit of the movie coming on, as these kids have built up uh, tough character shells. Uh, the they're no doubt still vulnerable kids, but uh, this uh, centerpiece of the movie is uh, very rich. And uh, David Lamb shoots in seemingly real locations to achieve this uh, quite terrific realism and atmosphere within the grounds of the orphanage in particular. Uh, the kids continue to learn of responsibility. On is uh, asked to raise his own uh, chickens, uh, which is the main symbolism uh, of uh, responsibility in the film. Uh, they they learn discipline, brotherhood, and chivalry. And uh, these neither obnoxious or cutesy kids uh, aren't too adult for the movie either. They're still kids, and it means director Lamb shows a keen understanding of children and has a fine sense of directing them naturally as well. Uh, the movie is also suitably enough uh, never a tearjerker as it's more busy filling us, uh, us and characters with uplifting notions and it has believable performances by Diana Yip, uh, Little Wong Yu Man and Simon Yan as an important aid for these two. And uh, to sum it up, Goodbye Mami is quite a superb, unknown, rare breed of its kind. It's a family melodrama that is sad and it's supposed to be that way.